way to take a look at the impact on teacher performance is through the lens of the Delaware Performance Appraisal System, provided by the Delaware Department of Education and through the work of Charlotte Danielson. Each of the four initial components of the DPAS-2 rubrics has criterion and level of performance. The four components include planning and preparation, the classroom environment, instruction, and professional responsibilities. We will hide the lower level of performance and see where the tasks and elements of the instructional technology placemat can support highly effective teaching. For example, placemat tasks that support the development of rubrics can help teachers show evidence that teachers' goals reflect high-level learning relating to curriculum frameworks and standards. Placemat tasks that support the differentiation can help teachers show evidence that they are adapted where necessary to the needs of individual students. And tools related to note-taking using pictures, images, video, audio, and class discussion permit the teacher with viable methods of assessment. Use of the LMS Schoology allows teachers to have or show elements of the instructional design and that teacher's lessons or unit is highly coherent and has a clear structure. Again, these tools that are at the hands of kids help engage them in a meaningful learning and show evidence of their input. Using the placemat as a whole supports the evidence that teachers can show that pedagogy is extensive, showing evidence of a continuing search for improved practice. The combination of both the rubrics that are developed and the placemat tasks that support analytics and student mastery can help teachers show evidence that the teacher is building on knowledge of prerequisites and misconceptions when describing instruction or seeking causes for student misunderstanding. Placemat tasks that again support differentiation can help teachers show evidence that demonstrate thorough knowledge of students' backgrounds, skills, and interest, and uses this knowledge to plan for individual student learning. Through the use of rubrics on the placemat, teachers can provide evidence that they plan for student assessment and that it is fully aligned with the instructional outcomes and uses clear criterion and standards that show evidence of student contribution to their development. And finally, placemat tasks that support differentiation can help teachers show evidence that assessment methodologies may have been adapted for individuals and the teacher intends to use assessment results to plan future instruction for individual students. The classroom environment, component two, really focuses on the iPads, which is the device we placed in the hands of students. For example, students in these environments assume considerable responsibility for their smooth functioning and student participation in setting expectations and monitoring behaviors. Students assume much of the responsibility for establishing a culture for learning in the classroom, as well as contributing to assurances that the physical environment supports the learning of all. When looking at component three for instruction, we see that a wide variety of tools and the tasks that are on the placemat can help teachers show evidence that students are making material contributions to the representation of content, the activities and the materials, and that students formulate many of the high level questions and assume responsibility for the participation of all students in the discussion. These tools allow for students' reflections and closure, and the teacher is highly responsive to students' interest and questions, anticipating possible student misconceptions. The teacher also employs cognitive coaching and questioning throughout the use of these tools, and that formative assessment is used regularly. 
With the use of analytics, the teacher is able to make major lesson adjustments if necessary. And the use of rubrics allows them to have assessments that are used in a sophisticated manner in instruction through student involvement in establishing the assessment criteria, providing high quality feedback to students. When it comes to professional responsibility, the use of Schoology allows a teacher to show evidence that they can communicate frequently with families, communication is sensitive to families, cultures, and values, the teacher successfully engages families in the instructional program, and students participate in communication with families. The use of analytics, the teacher maintains and records accurate data in an efficient and effective manner. Data is always recorded in a timely manner and readily accessible for those who have permission to access them. The use of a placement as a whole allows a teacher to make a substantial contribution to the profession through mentoring new teachers and pursuing professional development. 